conjunctive adverbs. That's what we're looking at now. A conjunctive adverb connects two ideas, two independent clauses. And here are some examples here. Now, conjunctive adverbs, they are not true conjunctions. And this is why a semicolon is required when connecting two independent clauses. And this is how it's done. Here you have the president will be attending the lecture. And because your next idea is quite close, you don't necessarily want to have this as a compound sentence or a new sentence. You want to have it uh, connected. So therefore, you use this conjunctive adverb. And to do that, you use a semicolon in front and a comma afterwards. And then you have the vice president will be available for the luncheon. So here, the two clauses are independent. And the semicolon replaces a coordinating conjunction and indicates that therefore they are two independent clauses. So this is why this is a compound sentence. And this is the same also for the next example. Jamie wanted to see Mission Impossible, semicolon. However, Nick wanted to see 28 days. It's purely a question of how you wish to formulate your thought through written language. And the choice is to have a full stop, and then Nick wanted to see 28 days, or you have a, a, a comma here, and you write, but Nick wanted to see 28 days, or you have this format here. The important part is that you don't mix up the different formats. Now, just one more thing about conjunctive adverbs. You have this form of punctuation when the conjunctive adverb is at the beginning of the second clause. However, if you're using this in this way, which I'm indicating here, an interruption of a thought, then it's not a conjunctive adverb, but an adverb. So, for example, either subject, however, is fine with me. The children, meanwhile, continued playing. Now, what you have in the middle here, this is a not a conjunctive adverb, but an, an adverb. It's something which is interrupting your, your thought. In fact, you can even see this when it is in spoken language. The children, meanwhile, continued playing. When you use the, the adverb here, you change the tone slightly. Listen, either subject, however, is fine with me. And you indicate this in speech through a change of tone and in writing with these commas.